Hey, hockey fanatics and power skating speed fanatics. It's Coach Dupra here with another episode of Dupra Power Skating. Obviously, we're taking a look and we're breaking down uh, technique and what makes Connor McDavid a dynamic, explosive, fast player. Can anybody say quick starts? Let's check that out again. If you don't have jump and explosiveness off the line, you're already behind in the game. And then the other thing I would I would have younger skaters especially focus on, if not to older, is that his feet and his skates are always churning. There's no glide in there. Even when he goes in behind the net, he's doing over speed, crossover, quick feet, and he's got pop and jump. Look how, how low he pushes his body, right? But he keeps his shoulders nice and level. He's not bent over at the waist. He's bending from the hips and the knees, but he keeps his shoulders up, and he never drops that inside shoulder to keep his edges anchored so you don't go into that fun drop where the shoulder goes down, the skates kind of domino into each other, and you do an awesome helicopter into the corner of the boards and all your buddies giggle. And we've all been there. And you can see his nice extension. And then for another video, I want to talk about each player's rhythm. There's a lot of things that, that make us very similar. There's a lot of things that you need to work on that also make you very unique. I wouldn't say Connor McDavid utilizes a full return. I'll, I'll break that down in another video, but his, his full breakaway stride extension versus his full return is not worth it to him because he does not want to give up on the foot speed and it works for him okay so now let's jump into the top five tips that help you create that breakaway speed Connor McDavid style using this video so Tip number one, we're going to go back in and take a look at this. Tip number one, explosive quick starts. Externally rotate your hips and your knees, toes. You can go lateral, but we always come back into the open toes to get on that inside edge and that forward lean. You don't want to be landing your whole skate. And then, of course, get into your full extensions. Drop your hips. The more knee bend, you can get down lower and get full pushes to the side. Followed up by overspeed crossovers. Foot speed is what's dominating here in the corners for him, almost shotgunning him out. Then he goes to one hand on stick because he knows that's where you're going to get your best power from your upper body, sink through your core all the way down through your uh, stride. On the turns, inside shoulders high. And then he drives low from his hips and his knees, not from his waist. And then you finish strong. You can see that nice full extension that he ends off flexing the ankle for even more pop on his pushes. And that's it. Connor McDavid style. 